So I was able to try the Firefox OS um, on my Mac. And as you can see, here it is. Um, very familiar the way the interface actually works. It's you know just like any other modern day smartphone. Uh, you have icons on your home screen. You can swipe between screens, between, between pages that is. Uh, you have a lock screen just like that. You have apps. And each app, as you can see, follows the, the circle pattern. So most of the apps here are circles. Not to say that that's going to be the final uh, the final look of the Firefox operating system, but you can get a good idea of the direction Mozilla is going. Here's the settings. You saw the uh, swipe down uh, options that allow you to toggle on Wi-Fi, airplane mode, Bluetooth, etc. Have some of your settings here. Keyboard options. So just a lot of different settings that apply more so to the actual hardware. It's, you're not going to be able to use most of these uh, on this software-based early build of Firefox OS. You can see here I'm changing the lock screen and the home screen wallpaper. So eventually I'm going to go back out here and show you what the new home screen and lock screen looks like. So again, this isn't going to be indicative of the final, you know, final build of Firefox OS. It's really hard to get a good idea of exactly how things are going to work because not everything's functioning now. And of course, this is just a software build. It's not running on any particular hardware just yet. But it does look promising. It looks an awful lot like uh, Android and iOS. It has all the features you would come to expect from a mobile device, including text messaging. They have a nice little test message set up here. You can delete, go into edit mode. You can, uh, of course, compose a new message if you want to do that. And they give some nice canned responses um, that allow you to kind of test out, you know, the different chat bubbles and things of that nature. But if you've used any kind of messaging um, app on a mobile device before, then this is going to be inherently familiar to you. See that keyboard there? That looks an awful lot like, it's actually, I don't know, more so Android-ish, but it does look like iOS as well. I guess a keyboard is going to be a keyboard, so you're not going to really have too much of a difference in that aspect, but there's no denying that there is a little bit of familiarity there. So I just sent a test message, and then you should see a, a can response, just like that. Hi, back. What's up? Hi, back. Not much. So you get a good idea of what of how the messaging will function. So what do you guys think about Firefox OS? I know this really doesn't give you a lot to go by. Um, this video doesn't really tell you too much, but you get a good idea of what direction that Mozilla is headed in and what you might be able to expect in the future once the Firefox OS launches. So let me know what you guys think. There's wiggle mode, by the way. But let, let me know what you guys think in the comment section about the Firefox OS. I know, again, this doesn't give you an absolute idea of what to expect, but it does give you a good indication. So I'm interested to hear what you have to say about this. What, how do you like the look so far? What do you think about it? Let me know in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.